on the tour next for the next two years. Congratulations. Yeah, look forward to seeing Jackson on the tour. I mean, Brandon Sargent, like you say, is very close to getting on the tour, and I've been watching him all after Den. A different sort of Coliseum to the Watford one. Thrones, he hit a cushion. Foul. No. Feel for him, because he, I think he's nervous. Going into the reds, trying to develop something. Cloud through. Nicely done. The play he was in was called Goli. Probably her first time at the Crucible. I, I always felt that he does look the part out there, John Ashley. It just looks as if he belongs. Still seven and a half minutes left. Right. But the break is over, he's playing safe. Now you've got to get lucky here. And at least he's hit one, but unfortunately no, you'd fancy him to get it. Could miss them. Made it a little bit run away into bolt, didn't he? Get back down for a red. The crowd go ballistic. No, they're basically well, it, with all due respect Dave if you call that old style etiquette then you no you're right there was, a, there was actually a good hush there but it is not like snooker that we know you sure you haven't got a prayer out there oh, didn't he hit that well straight in the middle of the pocket and look at him particularly fancy clearing I don't know it's an experience well he's 49 behind with four minutes to go but well, if he misses it he, he does the lot here oh, what a fabulous shot that is now One. look at the damn been coached by uh, Dave Deeks who a lot of snooker people will know from the friends with Ray Witt I think back in the day and one or two Harold, of course, another person that he digs. A bit unlucky there, I thought. He, not a particularly favourable kiss. Oh, no, not in off. Oh, that's oh. Curtin, surely. Of his hand. Played it quite nice. Kiss. Brandon Sargent needed there when he pulled that blue. If he'd hit that red half ball, I think he'd have been on one. Who knows where. Seven. So John Astley goes into the next round. Twenty-three. Yeah, tough one. What a shot! He barely put his bridge hand on the table there. Well, I think that was a very impressive display, despite missing that red. John Astley controlled things.